Small alleyway. Here, Ecleta. Mistheus, you came. Thanks to you, these people are safe. Call me Cassandra. Looks like the stranded people are settling in well. Resources are scarce, but we make do with what we have. These people have nowhere to go. Maroon, alone, far from home. I try to provide them a little bit of comfort. It's normal to be uncomfortable. Better even. That's a principle of Spartan training. It's how they become such fierce warriors. You remind me of my daughter. She was always aspiring to be better, to be great. <laughs> we all have things about ourselves that could be improved. These people will have to be their best selves if they're going to escape the Tempest. Her forces are monitoring the ships in and out of Achaea, and their control over the island is growing stronger every day. We need to get them out of here. Will you help me, Cassandra? I'll help. What do I need to do? Leaving Achaea is not going to be easy, but I've spoken to a few of the Stranded and we've come up with a plan. Find Dorondas. He's overlooking the fields. He'll have more information about this. of settling down is like a dream to me. I seem to go from one problem to the next. In that case, welcome to Vora. What brings you to Achaea? I've traveled across many seas, Mistias. The blockade paused my journey as a merchant, but Kleta gave me a place to stay. When you've been through as much as I have, when you've weathered the most horrific and turbulent storms, you start to appreciate the simple joys in life. Like Vora. A place I could call home. I fear these quiet times won't last. All peace is hard earned. It should be treasured. My sentiments exactly. Cleta sent me to you. She said you lost your ships. Indeed. We are in troubling times, Mistyos. Achaea is growing more dangerous by the day. And we need to escape while we can. I've discussed the plan at length with Cleta. Keep and... looking! Guards. They've upped their patrols. I caught their attention at the fort. They're looking for more stranded. We mustn't let them disrupt our peace, Mistyos. Deal with them quietly if you can. 
I'll get Kletter and the rest to higher ground. I have to stop them before they get to the village. Another one. Be careful. Remember what happened. <laughs> More guards, on horseback. Failed. Thank you, Cassandra. I... I knew they were on the move, but I didn't think it would be so soon. We need to set our plan in motion. Tell me what needs to be done. We need a mode of transport across the Aegean. The ships we came in were taken when we arrived in Vora by the foreman of the docks. Perhaps we can strike a deal with the foreman to get them back. I have the time to help you now. In that case, we should bring you up to speed on the foreman situation. I'm listening. He's quite a character. I've heard rumors that he frequents a tavern in Bellini, and drinks as if to endlessly worship Dionysos. Word is, he doesn't take well to mercenaries. I can get people to like me. I'm sure you have your ways, Mistyas. loved the water. As a girl, she always wanted to steer when we rode out to sea. As she got older... I've never stopped wondering if she will come back to me. There must be a reason why you're telling me about your daughter. My Phila. She captains the Skilla now. Your daughter is the Tempest? It's been years since I've heard from her. I, I, I pushed her too much, too far. And now it feels like I've pushed her away forever. It must be painful to realize what she's become. She's gone too far. Harmed too many. 
Now isn't the time to dwell on the past. Orondas needs our help. I'll go to Bellini and make myself useful. Here, Cassandra. I should get to Bellini. Come with me, my friend. Ride, Phobos!
Oceans are as wide as the world, but I've yet to find my equal upon them.
Here's the man we're looking for, Mistyos. Hare! Hare, my friend! <laughs> oh, I, I recognize you. I took your ships, didn't I? At the docks! <laughs> We've come to get those ships back. Why would be my first question. But then I realized I don't really care. <laughs> because you're a Mistyos! <laughs> Let... Bygones be bygones, my friend. We drink! Except for the mercenary. Now, sail away from me. <laughs> All right, you can't. <laughs> it seems like it'd be easier to silence you and your crew, then take back the ships. See? Your kind is always thirsty for bloodshed. Violence is not always the answer, Mistyos. This is why I hate mercenaries. They think violence solves everything. I can still hear you. Fine. Calm down. If you want to deal, we must do it like civilized individuals. What do you propose? Helping you would cost more than my left arm. If I am to risk incurring the Tempest's wrath, there should be a sizable benefit for me. I heard valuables can be found at Shipwreck Cove, not far from here. Or I could always use more Drachmi. Hmm? You can buy wine with Drachmi. I'll take a look around Shipwreck Cove for the valuables. Remember, Mistyos, I don't take trash! I got a That's what I'm looking for. There it is. Found it. Here it is.
There it is.
You have the valuables I want. I found what you wanted at Shipwreck Cove. Ha ha ha! Splendid! Hand it over. This will do. A deal's a deal. I never go back on my word. Only a dishonorable Malakas will break an oath. I'll give you your ships back. But good luck getting past the Tempest. Just take a good look outside at all those wrecks, Mistios. Now, if you'll excuse me. Thanks to you, Mistios, we have what we need. Now, we... Horondas! Cassandra! Mistios, no need for bloodshed. I just need you to come quietly, please. Releasing the stranded people has angered the Tempest. Someone just needs to take responsibility and everyone will be fine. Take me then. They have nothing to do with this. I'm the one you're after. We have done enough. There's no need to escalate this further. Promise me that you will see our plan through to the end. All this ruin, it's painful to watch. It feels like she's becoming someone I don't know. No matter what happens, blood is blood. She's still your daughter. Parents always believe in their children. As foolish as that may be. I should have stopped her sooner. Stopped her from joining the Order. I should have. When the time comes to face the Tempest, I feel like... What will you do, Cassandra? I'm sorry, Cleta. She needs to be dealt with. I was so proud of her. I don't think I ever told her that. There are still so many things I wish I had said. I should go help the rest. We'll meet up in Patre when we're ready. Thank you, Cassandra. For everything. 